Uh, let's try one right here. Uh, when is buying an extended two-year warranty actually worth it? A, a lot of times, sure. people will say, well, do you want the two-year warranty? Right. And you think, well, yeah, gosh, I better get it. But you but have to compare the price of the exactly. warranty to, you know, are you is really going really to it? pay yeah. off in the future? Okay, well, here's how uh, it showed up in charts and graphs. A car, you should buy the warranty 22% of the time. You buy it 22% of the time. a car. But if you get a computer... Uh, it drops down to 10% of the time. Of the time. <laughs> Cheeseburger, look at this, one one hundred thousandth percent of the time. For a uh, warrant. Tiny, tiny. Uh, well, uh, I would say, you know, it's only a the time. Yeah. Uh, and you know, this is funny. I asked myself this very question this morning, and I, uh, and I would have to answer yes. Do you miss hearing about former mayoral candidate Anthony Weiner? <laughs> And I thought, well, now that he's out of the race, it really is less interesting to me. 76% uh, of the people said no, that they don't miss don't him. Don't even miss don't, him. 24% yeah. uh, said, miss hearing about him, he just texted me. <laughs> so, there you go. Just texted me. Uh, usage of the phrase, uh, Polly want a cracker, among talking birds. This is very <laughs> unusual. Uh, this will be interesting to see how this is expressed. Usage of the phrase, Polly wants a cracker among talking among. birds. Yeah, 92% of the birds with various names repeating the phrase by rote. 92% birds with various names repeating the phrase by rote. I don't know what that means. You know what that means, Paul? Well, probably different various species of birds will repeat the phrase by rote. That's uh, the, uh, of, of, of the u overall universe of all birds, yeah. these are the birds which repeat the phrase by you. By okay, you. and then 8% of the birds named Polly expressing desire for a cracker. <laughs> I see. So, what's the species? Of very uh, names of the birds. Very Actually, let's give it names. Very given. esoteric. Yes. Uh, now, here's one a little more straightforward. Do you own a vibrating pen? I don't even know. Do you own a vibrating pen? I wish I owned a vibrating pen. No. 98% said, no, they don't own a vibrating pen. That's not surprising. And what did the other 2% say? Well, they said, eh, you can't read it. <laughs> well, read it. Read it. <laughs> uh, here's a popular one. Favorite Batman. Everybody has a favorite Batman. Favorite Batman. You know who was? Uh, George Clooney was Batman. He was. Yeah, he was a great Batman. Yep. I know who your favorite was. Yeah, who is that? Michael Keaton. Michael Keaton. Uh, okay, let's see if he's on the chart here. 11% said Michael Keaton. Ah, favorite so you, Batman. You would yep. be one of those I would 11. be right in there with that. 15% uh, Christian Bale. Yeah. And 74% said not Ben Affleck. <laughs> <laughs> makes no sense. Well, that's what they said. That's how they asked. Yeah. Survey said. This is what, you know, survey said. That's exactly what that's this what is. That's what this is. That's right. Of, uh -huh. yeah. Survey. Show me Ben Affleck. That's what this is a graph of. Yeah, yes, that's that right. type of behavior. Uh, this is about evil Russian President Vladimir Putin, oh, former yeah. uh, former uh, 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 spy, former what do they call KGB? Uh, KGB uh, officer. KGB. That's yeah. right. Uh, can Vladimir Putin be trusted? Uh, Eighty percent say no, absolutely not. Eighty percent. Twenty percent said yet. <laughs> yet. Yeah. Say yet. So basically, they're all they're the in the negative. Mm -hmm. Why did you buy the new iPhone? 22% said faster performance. 19% said sleek new interface. 59% yes. uh, said hoping consumer purchase will fill the emotional void that dwells within me. Uh, <laughs> wow. We're not going to do that number 10. Uh, best, no, we're not going to do that one. And finally, here's oh, the one okay. I was looking for. Finally, I find the lifeboat. Uh, why did Miley Cyrus and her fiancé split up? I did, see, I didn't even know Miley uh, Cyrus was uh, getting married. Did you know yes, that? Yes, I did. I no, follow no, no. these things, yes. Well, they split up. 26% uh, uh, said he didn't care for her wild image, 28%. 30% said their careers kept them apart. And 42% said she began to have feelings for the wrecking ball. <laughs>